So here we have to test these three functions and find in which cases the third derivative is the same as the first derivative. So I'll just start with the first one. Um, in case of e, the subsequent derivatives don't change. It's e to the x. Second derivative is also e to the x. And so yes, in this case, they are indeed equal. So one holds true. Um, and you'll see that that narrows it down to a and d. And then e to the minus x, dy over dx is going to be minus e to the minus x because you have derivative of minus x is minus 1. Second derivative is going to go back to plus because you have a minus here, you get another minus 1. And then the third derivative is minus e to the minus x. So in this case, yeah, they are uh, equal. So it's also 2, 1, and 2. So that actually narrows it down to choice d. I don't even have to do the third one, but I'll do it for completion. So dy over dx is equal to cosine x. Second derivative is going to be minus sine x. And then third derivative is going to be minus cosine x. So in this case, actually, they're not equal. So that's why 3 is out. The answer is 1 and 2 only, choice D.